Hi everyone, Petal is blessed here. I'm coming on today to share with you a cute little DIY that I have in mind to do. I have this square box here and um, I had bought two, I made a flower arrangement with one and I had this one sitting around so I said, you know what, I think I'm just going to bling it out and see how it looks. Yeah, <laughs> so let me show you the items that we'll be using. All right, everyone, <laughs> we have the square box like I told you like a little fence box and I have a candle holder from the Dollar Tree we have these paints here I'm gonna use for silver just to paint the background of the box and then we have our blinged out gems we have the medium gems and the large and small gems that we'll be using and we have our scissors our paint brushes and our handy glue gun <laughs> alright everyone let's get started alright everyone we're gonna start by painting our square box with this gray metallic paint all the way around just we're gonna paint everywhere <laughs> with the silver sorry not gray silver metallic paint that I have here and here we go here's our box all painted and dry and now we're gonna put our Rhinestones are going all the way around and bling out our box, you guys. First, I'm starting with the large rhinestones and just placing them all the way up. And now we're going to place the medium rhinestone and then a small rhinestone on the top, the very top. And this is how it looks, but I think I want to add a little bit more. I'm going to add the small rhinestones going straight across this empty, <laughs> the empty part of the box here. Just fill up with the rhinestones going right across. And then we're just going to bling out the rest of the box all the way around, you guys. And here's the finished look, you guys our picket fence square box all blinged out now I was gonna glue it onto the candle holder but when I saw it I said you know what this looks nice just by itself it looks very nice it can go as an accent piece it can go as a um, vase for flowers can go in it it could also go onto the candle holder and set as a larger candle holder I think it looks so nice so I'm going to show you the different options that we have for styling this blinged out. Oh, what should I call it now? My blinged out accent piece. Yeah. All right. Here we go, you guys. Okay. Here we have option number one. It's sitting on top of the candle holder. And you can display it as a candle holder. Put your candles inside within a glass container. Put your candles inside and burn your candles. It makes a lovely candle holder. That's option one. Okay, you guys, I had forgotten to mention that I had put some rhinestones on the inside of the box. Four rhinestones in the four corners. As you can see here, one, two, three, four, into the four corners of the box. So I just wanted to point that out to you guys. And now we're going to go into option number two, which we're placing some flowers into the box all by itself. No candle holder, just placing some flowers into the box, into the blinged out box. Doesn't it look nice with the flowers? I think it looks very nice. And now for option three, you can place the vase your blinged out box on top of the candle holder so it's elevated if you like it to be a little higher it's elevated so this is option three and this is option four you guys just laid out on a display stand like an accent piece this option is very nice I like this option the best 
And option six is placing flowers while it's on your display stand. Is another option for you to display it as display number six, you guys. With or without the flowers, it looks lovely. I just love how this picket fence square box turned out all blinged out. I think it looks lovely. And you know, you can use the rhinestones that you can get from Walmart and bling it out. And you can also get rhinestones from um, Michael's and do up a box like this for yourself. It looks very nice. All right, everyone, thank you for coming on and seeing the DIY that I had to do for today, this blinged out box. And you know what, you guys, it's giveaway time again. It's giveaway time again. It's giveaway, it's giveaway, it's giveaway time again. <laughs> All right, everyone, it's, another, it's time for another one of my bling giveaways. For you guys, we're going to have two winners. This time for this bling giveaway and remember it's international people in the US not for anyone in Canada I'm so sorry you can go to Dollarama and get these blings for yourself so it's for my US and international residents only all right let me show you what you're gonna get in the prize package we have our five gems that's always gonna be in our package yes our blinged out rhinestones <laughs> that we have here and I also have this rose pink metallic um, blinged out wrap also. <laughs> and then I have these glass seed beads in gold. This will be in our package also. And we have these rhinestones, you guys. Three pack, three different kinds. Rhinestone pearls, and then these little flower things. All blingy. <laughs> and we have some pearls. All right, you guys, like I said, there'll be two winners for this giveaway. And the giveaway is going to run from September the 23rd, which is today, until October the 1st, 2017. And the rules are you must be subscribed to my channel. You must like this video. <laughs> and also, um, <clears throat> I need you to tell me which option is your favorite option. Option 1, 2, 3, 4, or 5. I think there's only 5. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, tell me which option was your favorite in the comment section below and I'll know you're entering into this giveaway. Remember, must be a subscriber, like my video, tell me which option was your favorite and it runs on September the 23rd until October the 1st. Alright everyone, good luck and thank you and remember as always, stay blessed from Petal is Blessed. Bye bye everyone. Baby